Hey Dwight, James Margarello here, Elvis Tree Climber, end of the job video. Now, I already shot one of these and it wasn't good enough because, you know, after we took the Brazilian pepper tree out of the backyard, there was still a big patch of vines around the pine trees that we couldn't see. Anyway, abracadabra, those two trees are gone, cleaned up stumps of ground. Brazilian pepper tree, I don't, I didn't shoot a beginning video, I guess I was talking to you on the phone, assuming that you kind of lived around here somewhere. Anywho, the Brazilian pepper used to go from here all the way over there and encompass the whole area. It was only a stump probably about 12 inches, about as big as my foot. But Brazilian pepper trees, if you look at them, they're evasive and they just take over whole areas. Three quarter pepper, three Brazilian peppers will take over a quarter acre. So the stump was back there. I just came back, had the guys pull the fences. We couldn't get back there. I'm like, yeah, we can pull the fence down, old rickety piece of crap. Piece it back together the best you can. But anywho, that being said, and these little girls right here, I believe this could be an offshoot. So tell the tenants here. No, not this one, but definitely that one. Those are Brazilian peppers. So tell your 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 tenants here to please mow back here so they don't come back. When I came back earlier, this whole thing was full of vines all the way up to here, and I just couldn't leave that, even though it wasn't part of the job. So I ripped them out. I actually shoved them in the woods across the road, one big, huge grapple full. And I came through with my brush hog, and I brush hogged this, so maybe it'll turn back into lawn if somebody will think about mowing it. It's also a big pile of crap here that I've been throwing over the fence for a while, just rotting away, overtaken by weeds and shit. And I went in ahead and I uh, brush hogged that. So now when you look at it, you got a yard again. So anywho, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and I'll upload this to YouTube here shortly. I'll send it to you. I already sent you an invoice earlier. And you made a mistake. You texted me to do sixteen hundred. You look at the proposal. It's eight hundred for the Brazilian pepper, free for the vine. One thousand for the oak tree, and one hundred for that little thing over there. So, that being said, lo and behold, hey guys, you guys are gonna start buying me rakes. That being said, thanks for work, Dwight. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope this gets to you. Talk to you later. Bye.